Hello, my dudes, and welcome back to some more Fallout 4 Horizon. Okay, so we've got a whole heap of ammo from the last session, and uh, yeah, we got heaps of shotgun ammo. So that means that we could go and do a couple of quests in the area. And we need some energy cells more than anything. Where's this one? That's not too far north. Yeah, we can go and do that one. And go and do this quest. The main goal is going to be for us to get adhesive so we can make more robots. As, uh, yeah. If you happen to be joining me on uh, this episode and you have never watched one before, I'll give you a little bit of context. Uh, Horizon is a major overhaul and uh, we are currently playing on the desolation mode which is the hardest difficulty on survival um, but we're doing it so it's no settlers and no minutemen so far so we are pretty much relying completely on the um, robotics workbench to actually uh, produce workers and settlers so make it a little bit more difficult on ourselves but I like the difficulty and the grind. Need one fusion cell. Yeah. Now let's get our scrap on whilst we're going. Let's scrap these vehicles as we're going. Get the uh, the vehicle parts out of them. Get the nuclear material and wipe all the crap out of it. Really liking uh, getting this scrapping skill up as high as possible, as early as possible, so then we don't have to worry about backtracking too much. That's a vehicle down there that we got to remember. Hangman's alley is pretty much empty. So I think we want to populate Starlight Drive-In with a few few robots. You can get that as a fast travel point so we can get around the map a little bit easier. We can go up north and do stuff there if we need to. Now it has been interesting so far because the thing is we have like pretty much no settlers and we've always any place where we have our robots like Grey Garden we've just made sure that it has ridiculous defense. So, it's never attacked ever. Uh, trying to remember what this place is. <laughs> Cambridge Polymer Labs. New production is now ready. The production cycle's done. Cool. This sounds like it'd have... Maybe a fusion core in it. I think there's a quest associated with this one. It's a, it's a random assaultron tool, sir. Let's go in here and see what's happening. Welcome to the Cambridge Polymer Labs. Employ
employment opportunities await in the field of scientific research. Shall we begin your application now? Sure, the world may have ended, but why not sit at a desk all day? Let's see what employment opportunities we have available for someone given your qualifications. Due to increased demands for staff in all fields, we have condensed the employment test accordingly. Question one, do you possess previous experience with polymer synthesis? Sounds like you need me regardless, so let's get down to brass tacks. Calculating test results. Ah, damn. I am pleased to offer you the position of lab assistant. Expect a bright future in observing test equipment. Would you like the orientation before beginning your work in the labs? Uh, yeah, I guess. Please note that employee enthusiasm is factored into your yearly reviews. <laughs> I can hack her and get her as a robotic follower. Find an open seat, and we will begin the presentation. The genesis of Cambridge Polymer Labs lies in the research of a group of brilliant graduate students. John Elwood, Erica Woolham, and Wilfred Bergman met during their time together at CIT. This slide shows them at their graduation. Their research into nucleostrictive and piezoelectric polymers caught the attention of Colonel George Kemp in the fall of 2073. In the spring of 2074, the company was founded with a generous grant provided by the Defense Experimental Research Project Initiative. The research produced here has resulted in several of the components used in the Liberty Prime project that led to the successful defense of Anchorage. The company enjoys a strong relationship with the military and welcomes your addition to the research team that helps build a better America. Please follow me to the research lab so that you may begin your work. Complimentary beverages are provided for employees. Please label any food or cigarettes you leave in the break room. Quantum. Nice. Ooh, magazine package. What do we get? Medical school. Okay, cool. Here is your lab coat and clipboard. Please take a moment to dress in your proper work attire and follow me into the clean room. staff will greet you on the other side of the clean room. Thank you for your attention and welcome to the team. I'm really tempted to hack her, but I don't want to break the quest. I have been instructed scanning or contamination. Director Elwood has issued mandatory overtime due to uncompleted milestones. Consequently, staff will not be allowed to leave the labs until the piezo nuclear plant is completed. sucking down a lot of rats here. Please report to the project lead, Dr. Elwood Wooler, for specific research assignment. Starting decontamination sequence. I'm guessing then we gotta find the other samples. Oh, ghoulies. This is one grim locale. Sounds like they're above. Oh, that's a dead end. 
with some reds. Oops, no, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to smack him. <laughs> Give me an infection. I'll wait till we after we get out of this place to see how bad the infection gets from getting smacked by feral diseased ghouls. I'm gonna get a nice haul of random stuff here, like microscopes and stuff. Another sample over there. Got some education material out of that one. We'll try to mathematics. And that was an expert one. I'm so glad they're best smart enough to make auto hackers, but we can't hack ourselves. Password. I think from memory there's a, um, a whole heap of lore for here, but I ain't gonna read through it. I'm pretty sure, like when the bombs dropped from memory for here, that there was um, a few scientists working here and they got locked in and not told that the bombs had dropped. And that's just pretty much like lied to and forced into working. One of them sabotaged the place and made it so the lockdown happened, so... Ended up trapping the people that trapped him inside with him. else left tried to get into Bergman's lab to get the password for the ice to containment but he rigged up some kind of gun. Erica was killed. Most of my hair is gone from the radiation I can barely see. There's no other way I can finish the research on my own so I've chosen to take a quicker end. When I will I'll see you in hell. Tom Franklin. Yeah. And so this guy shot himself because he was trapped in here. Okay, 
Okay, so... So begin then with mass extrusion pattern 1142. So lithium, hydride, and gold. Lithium, hydride, and gold. Lithium hydride and gold. We need a radioactive isotope. isotope in order to get this going. Where is that? Definitely pop some antibiotics. To fight this infection. So that's gallium. So we still need to find this radioactive isotope. Maybe the, we can go on a bit further in the vents. We almost missed this room. for there. And this one's dropped down for here. I'm pretty sure we went in this room already. Bunsen burner. So there's something I needed to use in the computer up there.
There we go. I think we just did the manual override then. Director's key. <laughs> Sample sixty five. So that's where I needed to go into to get the radioactive isotope. So how did I, how would I get into here? Okay, it was just this door here then. Nope, oh, we just completely missed that. I think we need to go through here. Let's have a look at uh, buffs. No. <clears throat> Get some rad resistance going on. Radioactive isotope from in here. See you if we get something juicy from this because we're fabricating something. Observe at a viewing point. Ah. this radiation exposure increases action, po action point refresh speed nice that's very very nice cool Sense the wall panel. Okay, it looks like yeah. Can only get the one from it. I wonder. So we had the lithium hydride and gold. So hydronic acid and let's go gold. Don't make anything? Uh... <sighs> 
I wonder if this, if it makes power armor parts. Very selective. So, lead. This is golden lithium hydride. Okay, so that's the one that we did before, golden lithium hydride. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the one that we did before, but I'm just going to run it. Okay, that did nothing, so we got that one. Look at on the other computers, did they mention other recipes? That's just the security door. That's about our wood hacking, the system, and something about mandatory override. Okay. It doesn't seem like there's any other recipes, but we'll have a look at what else is on this computer. This would be cool if we could make a few. Yeah, nothing's been made. It'd be cool if we could make a few armor parts, especially if they're legendary. Getting us out. Subroutines, confidential. Yep, mandatory overtime. No. Project thesis, that's that one. So thermal dissipation. Still problems that we need to overcome. Can I get into gold? Suspension. Tensile strain. That's him complaining about trapped. No, I still gonna look down, leaving my main strand inside. Okay, yep. No mentioning of other recipes. Mm. But that is cool. Got a bit of power armor. What kind of armor is it? Must be T45 or T50 or something. Okay, well that was a nice little bit of EXP. of them to be pissed at me. Using nuclear material ain't bad. Hmm. 
Nothing, it's just the toilets. What's upstairs? Functioning. I got so excited when I saw that. Give me a proper fusion core. Scrap from here. Lots and lots of typewriters and desk fans. And lots of basic circuitry from here. Okay, cool. This place is definitely worth it. Most we've got a, uh, a little bit of a loading screen here. I want to say thank you to people that have been showing support with the series so far. All the likes and the regular viewers. And the people that get towards the end of the uh, episodes and see my goodbye messages. And hear them. Um, uh, yeah. Appreciate you guys. Okay, so... Nah, that was a long loading screen. I was like, hmm, I just want to check that it's actually picking up everything, but I'm like, nah, it'll... The game will take care of it, it was all tagged for retrieval. I'm just gonna have a ridiculous amount of stuff that, um, Wilson is transporting around. I suppose that we could come back and have an attempt at this one. a boom boom right there. 
I don't have any explosives to deal with it, and that's exactly what killed me last time. Hunting rifle, radiated, scoped, and heavy. And get some nice energy cells out of that. Have to loot all of the super mutants inventory. And then scrap it later! That was a close one. I've got a couple of sealed magazine packages now. I suppose next level I should look at what um, upgrades I need to get to be able to improve my armor even more. So I'm just thinking of ways to try and save adhesive and definitely having some damage reduction will be worthwhile in the long run. Excuse me. Swish. Damn. Ah. Got it. We're watching a conductor at the orchestra. Watching a conductor at the orchestra. Do you like that, Nick? I like it when I pick a lock. That's right. Came from this way. Looping around this way, make sure. Who killed the lights? Make sure we go through this place systematically and clear it out. So otherwise, I will forget where I have and haven't looted, and I miss things. A swish. Like that. Perfect. Okay, that's everything in here. Oh, 
got through fine that time. The last time we went through there, we um, killed Deadeye. And then immediately ran over to go and kill his friends with a shotgun and just got blown up by that landmine. Oh, some cars. Getting salvage and skill left, right, and center. I wonder what max is now. I think I've got it up to like 140 previously. I do wonder if you don't take the perks, then you won't get an additional like cap on it, so you won't be able to do the master stuff. Like the master stuff with the skills, like being able to salvage cars and stuff. Thirty-two. And we're back here. You guys chilled out, or are you still? <clears throat> Check your fire. We've got hostiles. Yep, you're still on alert. And find out if one of the enemies is just hiding around here somewhere. And that can be a mystery for another day. It's a good thing that we don't want to do the Brotherhood of Steel at the moment with this character. Salvage, salvage, salvage. So I'll scoop up all the scrap for me. I'm gonna try to swarm around here somewhere. This area already. I just missed that one ten mil round. Yeah, that's right. This is a third person animation for this. I always forget about this. Yes, wrench the ground. I go. brown I thought you were too rusted to be salvaged loving this salvaging skill so good Okay. 
What do we get out of this? Trading skill. Okay, but operation stealth skill as well. Okay. And we don't have any healing. Just notice that there's a um, like warning sign sitting above a health bar on the left. Let's see if we have any. Uh, apparently, no problems. Thought it was trying to tell me that I was um, a disease or was over encumbered or some shit. You are hostile. I can hack you. Devil cometh. A day is a hard working introducing the black devil by day a hard working janitor cleaning the toilets at the local police station by night. He's a commie fighting superhero here to uphold our core values of truth, tax loopholes, and the principles of free market. Okay. Working with the US government, the black devil gained his superhuman strength by merging his body with the constant with the constitution. Covered in the impenetrable ink of our founding fathers, he hunts down Communists with gusto, known only to the devil himself. So when communists invade, and it would just tune your what's brand radio to 810 or FM. Make sure you turn the dial all the way up. Only when you play the music of America will the black devil recognize you as a true patriot and come to the rescue. Fuck. As a true patriot the, patriot, the black devil loves all songs that celebrate America, but for the large and illustrious catalog, there are in three in particular distinguish themselves as his favorites battle him with the republic is a song that foretells the judgment of the wicked for when the end of red army hears its melody on the breath of our soldiers they will crumble in agony and pain as their ears are too frail to withstand the sheer sonic power of freedom okay yeah stars and stripes blah 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 yeah okay the devil wants these songs on his note since we've been fighting off radios ever since we moved back home, bastards like I like roaches. You kill one, ten more crawl out of the cracks. Promised Pa how to deal with them, but he said he wouldn't have to. Back in the day, there was this guy. They called him the Black Devil, and he made him a mission to drive all the raiders out of the Commonwealth. Whenever you needed his help, you just turned on the radio to his station, and there he'd be. So naturally, I wanted to know what happened to him. Pa said he didn't know. About a year ago, the radio went static, and it's been a radio ever, radio heaven since, ever since. But last week I was at the old ones looking for scrap and came across that dis this display that mentions the devil by name. There's also a couple of holotapes which I couldn't make heads or tails of so I asked my cousin Richie for help because he's good with this stuff. He thinks the tapes might have music in them, a way to summon the devil. The blurb on one of the holotapes mentions two radio stations. He just thinks it might be tied to the old relay towers with the same numbers just northwest of here. I've just been praying and feeling like we've been following the sun trend and blah, blah, blah. Okay, you want to bring back the devil. Okay, we're going to investigate this comms relay really tower. Troll your area, very own machine army with a mechanism remote. Use the antenna to guide robots to the destination or press the den detonation button to watch them explode. Oh, okay. Oh. Wouldn't want it going to waste now, would we? Can I turn you off? Do 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 do. Good day to you. 
Oh shit! So if I drop one, the other one fucking gets up. This is how you repay me? Give you life. Protect and serve. Okay, the next one I'll bash. I'll bash to pieces instead of uh, wasting the ammo. Come on, where's the swish? Where's the sweet spot? Not there. Ah. That's it. We got going on up here. Assistant manager handy. Get out of there. I can't remember how to rotate things with this. Just. Ooh. Give me the whiskey. There's nothing in that safe. Mm, duct tape, yes. Jump, mate. Coming through. as well. Pretty nice. Yeah, that's a downstairs section. Okay, so if we break the locks we don't get the EXP, but we do get the skill increase. some first aid supplies. There we go. Now what is down here? Get the 
3 EXP from them whilst they're down. Because I imagine once I get down the bottom, it's going to be like, oh yeah, all the robots have been activated. Fight your way out. bits of adhesive so far. Guys, beefy. Run away. Not today. Get in there, Nick. Restore contact with Wait enemy, goddammit! Now we'll snoop him out. Where's the uh, Protectron that I hacked? Fugitive has been located. Commencing attack. Running will only make the pain last longer. Jump move. Get out of my way. Stop blocking me on the staircase. Get up there. You guys get in the fight. Go protect John. Get in there. You're in for it now. Come on guys, I can't do this all myself. As soon as I go up there, you're gonna block the freaking staircase. Burning him at all? Doesn't seem like it. Oh, someone should make it. Okay, that guy was tough.
Okay, I do not have any healing. So it means we might have to do a quick bit of field. Field crafting. Medical crafting. I've got 15 adhesive, we'll make 5. What did we get? I'm seeing chance of avoiding all damage. Okay. Got some healing going on, just gonna wait for that to tick up. Did the Protectron survive? Yeah, he's still going. Hopefully he follows us out. It'll be useful. Protect and serve. Yes. Hmm. Enjoying the look of this character. Don't mind the greaser jacket and jeans. Underneath the armor. Like a, uh, a rebellious robotics man. It's exactly what we want, right? Mm. Oh, here we go. Okay, let's go and check out this relay tower. See if we can incite this devil. How far away is it? It's a decent ways away. Yeah, this is the boom boom bridge. Cargo boom? Mm, that went boom. There we go. Noise. Oh. Physics is going a little bit crazy, but it's to be expected. Do we need did we need to cross here? No, let's go to the other bridge. It's gonna be a shorter trip. from me, bugs. Bloody <laughs> blood bug poisoned me. There we go. Need to craft a few more of them. And the shotgun rounds are serving us pretty well. Stash likes a Simon. Okay. We got some named characters on the bridge. How are you guys? I'm gonna try and get me to pay a toll. Hi. You look 
like you could use a little pick-me-up. Am I right? Let's see what you got. Exactly what you need. First aid supply. No, I don't want that. I want buff help. I'll take some of that though. Chill and Psycho. I'll take that. And you want some cigars? Count the cigarettes. You guys are just the muscle. What's this place? Beside an energy turbine? This sounds like a place that I could definitely take over and upgrade and get power. Power production. You still coming, Protectron? Still following us? Robotics experts, pretty cool. I wonder if we um, get the bonuses of Lone Wanderer if we just use these sort of companions. Got those stutters every now and again, and just the auto saves. Definitely want to be playing modded version of Horizon on an auto save. It's just in case it crashes. Oh, get out of that water place. Hello. <laughs> Today, Excellent. nice. Seven, six, two rounds. You protect your That scared me. Slayer deadly as catch at it. Is that a perk or something? that was that popped up. And what are our special stats for this? Okay, 8 intelligence, 8 agility, 7 luck. Yeah. Completely forgot about what stats we were running. I have been playing New Vegas a little bit just on the side just to rekindle the flame a little bit. Vegas is so good. And what sort of weapons do you have? You have the 
railway rifle ones. Protectron. So, uh, I can't scrap the ash piles, damn. That guy really disliked me doing that. I thought he was just going to leave me be whilst he blew up. But we're going to get an upgrade because this guy has the, um, the railway gun. It does ridiculous amount of damage. Can I hack you? Do pickpocket. Hello? There we go. Command. You are mine. Intruder. I think hostile target identified. Cool. Combat rifle 30. Uh, some of the raiders are spawning with decent gear now. Okay, we got Rayleigh with us. You can come and help us clear out this area. Face me, you coward! Go, come here, mutant hound. Stop running around me. Where are you? Are you shooting me from there? Okay, that hurt. Alright. Time to run away. Take too much damage. That's a mine. Get yeah, I got a nice long range weapon now. Let's protect runs doing work. We can go into town.
Go really, go. Smash him. Kill them all. Not going too much. I'm still so happy about this chest rig. Very, very keen to put this on. Such a bait with the old uh, malfunctioning fusion core there. I just want to go around in my power armor. I am detecting predators tracking your position. Yeah, have you killed any everything in here, Rayleigh? You survived. What's getting hostile on us, sir? You doing work, man? I'm glad I got you. Got hammer. Nope, oh, I'm keeping you around, really. You barely even lost any health as well. Super Sledge, okay. Can I scrap ammo? I can't remember. Giant rounds.
Okay, so, so I can break down the ammo. I just can't break down the missiles and stuff. Okay, that's one way to save some space. Steel production is now ready. It's empty, but I'll open it up for the experience. Oh, looks like we could catch a breather in here. And get some duct tape in here. Don't see any remains down here. I think this thing. Okay, nine dog training manual. Is there anything on Wayne's terminal? Mama, this is David, the bad. Mama, this is David, the bad man came back. <laughs> <laughs> Sucked in, kid. It's my jangles now. So from from memory, I think there was a family or a few families that were staying in this town. It was well fortified. I had food and shit. And then the mutants and raiders. Well, raiders came through and killed everybody, and then mutants came through and killed them. It's very very deep lore. This isn't a work site. Can you, uh, out of the doorway. Thank you. Told you before. Oh, wait. I'm gonna hold on to the Ripper. There isn't too many of them. <clears throat> yeah, it seems like we should summon a Wilson as well. Wilson! Meat, moldy food, rotten vegetables. The super sludge is twenty. Mm, 
Yeah, we'll send it back. I'm trying to remember that we have it later. It'll be a nice surprise. I don't think it's a necessary upgrade at the moment. We're not really struggling when it comes to melee damage. Okay, I'm gonna hold on to that armor though, so we don't forget about it. Send all those ones back. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. Here you go. I oh, wait, actually. Missiles. And we have a bit and that and that. So we're cooking up some raiders. Wake master alarm clock. Mm. Ally scraps in that one. Some out of beer. Warning. Union violation detected. Last recorded break was nine thousand nine hundred ninety nine hours ago. I don't care about your breaks. I just want to get into this safe. Why do you take up so much room? It's going to be so brutal when I eventually get my own personal robot. When I want, once I get enough robots to be able to fill the settlements, and then just have one that's going to follow me around. See, so I just unlocked that, and I need to get to it. You not do this shit. Oof. Out of the way. Okay. No, don't get fucking stuck. Are you just... Are you doing this on purpose? Like... I just unlocked the safe. Come away from it. Yep. You too, Nick. Get out of the way. Thank you. No. Don't block the doorway now. You. God, the NPCs are so frustrating in close quarters environments. Like, you know, when you're, you're, That's you're going, going shopping and, like, going through the grocery store and you just happen to, like, be in a rush and you're walking, like, down the aisle and the person's just dead center, just dawdling along, just not paying attention whatsoever. Like, with their basket swinging out to the side as well, like, completely unbalanced with the way that they're sitting and walk, well, not sitting, walking. It's like, just fucking pick a side, for fuck's sake. Make room for people. Shit. Holy shit. That guy killed he he killed me, killed me. Is Horizon not working properly at the moment? Am I not being dragged back to the settlement? No. Well, I wouldn't be surprised if Horizon isn't working properly.
No, 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 fuck off. Some of the times I hate the way that um, these lists move around. You can do one thing and it upcycles. I don't even know how I can fucking articulate what the thing is, is that I'm frustrated about. I'll be back to you on that one. Hmm. Yeah, I wonder if Horizon isn't working properly, because usually I would be dragged back to the settlement and stuff. Yeah, a little bit of a pain in the butt. The main system in Horizon's not working. Okay, you assholes and fuck off. Move. Out of the way. Out of the doorway. Come on, come on. Not you too, Nick. Get out of here. It's a double door. Get him. That's how we do it. Ooh, ship. trying to lead me over towards the settlement. I think not. Mm, actually, sun is getting pretty low. Are you? I was trying to run backwards, and I'm pretty sure either Nick or the Protectron was just standing right behind me. I ain't going through this shit again.
Ah, shut up. Groundhog Day. up there. Wonder why I got blown up. Gonna splatter your brains. Unidentified. Like a walking target out here. Beginning You guys come and help me. on a dime. So you see how beforehand what I was complaining about is that as I do this, the bottom of the list gets consumed by the top part of the list. So you see what happens once it stops having a scroll? See, it didn't do it. Okay, never mind me. Shut up. I'll, I'll just shut up. I'm good. Don't worry. It's fine. I was just frustrated. Ignore me. this guy to salvage this shit so it doesn't blow up in my face freaking dag To mark one, I can't scrap most of it. Yeah, so with that delay, we're definitely gonna <laughs> we'll head over to the settlement nearby and do our wind down. So, we don't want to be going out at night time. be nice at some stage or another to do a stealthy nighttime player and do a playthrough like suppressed pistols and shit and just suppressed weapons in general don't mind me a stealthy playthrough the only thing is is uh 
It's very, very overpowered after a little while. You're gonna be literally be right next to somebody and shooting an enemy and they'll just be completely oblivious. This is a Fallout game. I cannot expect like Splinter Cell from it. Oh wow, really? Is salvaged. Yeah, that's right. I've already done that one. Done all the upgrades and repairs. The little marker to remind you that it's there is like good. I just wish that it would disappear once you're um. I've actually upgraded the settlement. Scrap trash research, 79 vendor credits. It's pretty good. Crude oil, oil, brown milk. Got lots of razor grain coming in. We got three tar berries. It's very nice. I reckon we could definitely make a few more robots out of that. But we'll save that for when we get back to home plate full shizzle. Don't want to do that. Let's do a quick. Do a field scrap. Get rid of the things that we don't need. Here. I ain't putting on a freaking hard hat. Shut up. I own you. There we go. I know that. This mechanical keyboard and the double presses some of the times. Okay, get some fertilizer out of that once that cycles through. And uh, technology wise. Yeah, we could get some harvesting. We'll leave the training sessions for later. We can do a little bit of a leap forward once we get back. I'm getting closer and closer on those synth parts. Let's tag them all for search. Ah, uh, yes. I should... ...make some power cells. That'll mean that I can use my, um, engineer devices. Make sure we get some engineer kids going on. Some explosive charges. And we can make a cargo boat if we want. Yeah, we don't need it. Don't need the carry weight just yet. Technology and workshop. Uh, chemistry, medical. 
No, oh, we can make a revival stim pack. That's very nice. A little bit of first aid. Modified baseball. Syringer, uh, eh, thought about using it, but Psycho Jet's where it's at. Slow down time and increased melee damage. Let's end up getting in there. Okay, cooking and supplies. We don't have any access to hydrated meals. Wheel of cheese. Sheet. Let's see a man about some two mil vice ammo. Some more shotgun shells as well whilst we're here. Won't make heavy fusion cells. Yeah, plasma cartridge. Yeah, I can science a 40. Just need some energy cells for it. Mm. In combat of the custom, I can't remember which one's better. So the custom vice pistol. I always like that one. That was a really nice weapon. That's right. When we get back, we'll try to remember to have a look at the um, a plasma rifle, the custom one, and whatnot. See which one we can get. Canister of fuel. Do with some more glue there. So it's 10 fusion cells and you get 10 vice. Cost 10 caps. List of wave mark one. Uh, it's not worth it, not at the moment. Okay, and the polymer one we can't quite get yet. We haven't got the tailoring skill for it. And we can chuck an augment on it. for that one.
That's kind of cool. Can't put any augments on that one. Grease jacket. So, okay, scientist rank four, armor rank four. Flex weave. That's tailoring and survival. Mystic weave mark two, insulated weave mark one. Okay, we don't have the skills to do that stuff yet. a super sledge heating coil okay so that's 121 an extra eight so 129 154. Yeah, we could put cryo damage on it. And put a lock on this one. So all these ones take a decent amount of metalworking skill. Efficiency Malay combat. So we need metalworking for this. Sledgehammer. Let's go standard. Hardened. Okay, so I can't take this mod off. Poisoned and irradiated. I can put no augment on it though. So you're hardened and poisoned, so 64 and 3. And you're hardened one. Okay, and then I just need the metalworking skill for that. Place an irradiated three. Chemistry and science. So you just need hematoxin for that. And first strike damage. Yeah, let's go for it. I like this one. Radiated six on it for the time being. Okay, not bad. Let's have a look. Get some upgrades. Only imagine what being out here is doing to my Oh, I need strength of eight. Okay. What strength do I have? Six. Alright, so it's something I can use in the power armor if I want to. Okay, nice to know. Would be good if that actually came up. Like on the stats anywhere on the left at all, like strength requirement. Because this is all metalworking. I 
Okay, super sludge is nice, but we're gonna have to send that home. I don't want to hack you. Can you get out of the way, Ray Rayleigh? Being a pain in the butt. Okay, super sludge can go away. You'll get transported back home. Make sure we go through and get rid of all of this stuff as well. Legs can go away, all of these rounds can go. I don't want a vice. Okay, it's all done. Mailbox depositing time. That's all done, that's done. We've gone through the crafting cycle, made some more ammo. Yeah, okay. Oh, let me just need a wee little teensy weensy bit of lighting for here. So, it's that time again, guys. Um, like and subscribe, and let me know that you want some more in the comment section below. And uh, let me know uh, if you want some more, yeah, in the comment section below. I'm repeating myself. Alright, I'm done. Bye, 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 bye. Thank you for watching today's adventure. If you enjoyed it, please subscribe and like. And, uh, yeah, check out my Patreon in the description below, and I'll catch you all in the next one. Bye!